All right, I'm back with another Sudoku today. Uh, this one is a between Sudoku, which should be interesting. Uh, it's by somebody that I've never seen before. Don't know who they are, but the puzzle looked interesting, so I'm going to try it. Uh, I've got it in F puzzles today, and um, I guess I have a, a small confession to make first before we start the puzzle. I actually changed it slightly. The original puzzle looked like this, and I actually thought it kind of looked like a... Uh, a, a Viking or some some sort of big boat if you turned it sideways so I decided to turn it just because I thought it looked cool that way um, and so it's kinda like uh, you get the boat down here with the the sail and I guess maybe these are birds flying in the air I don't know either way uh, I didn't quite know if this was supposed to be any specific shape so the puzzle is the same whether you turn, you know, if you turn a Sudoku 90 degrees, 180 degrees, it's the same thing, so it doesn't make any difference, but. So, I turned it. You can do it either way. Uh, and the rules are pretty simple, just normal uh, between rules. So, the digits in the circles um, are the, the extremities, essentially, and all the digits on the line have to be between those two. So, if these were a 1 and a 9, you could put anything on there. If these were... Uh, four and a six, you'd have to have only fives on the line, something like that. So, And then little killers, um, the digits outside the grid give the sum of the digits along the diagonal. So, for example, those have to sum to 41. And that's it, just normal, um, pretty standard rules today. So uh, I am going to give it a try now. The, there's a link in the description where you can try this puzzle yourself, and we'll see how it goes. So... Um, I, the, the, the problem with betweens, uh, when you're first starting is that there's just so many options. Now we are somewhat limited on this one because we know there's at least seven unique digits between these two, because these all along here have to be different. So these are going to have to be one and nine. Um, because you're going to have to put 2 through 8 in here, which means these are also going to have to be 1 and 9, and the you know, kind of opposites, so like 1's here and 9's there, or the other way around. Um, now these... So you can repeat digits on a between line, uh, which you're obviously going to have to do in here. These are going to be 2 through 8, and then these are going to have to uh, then be... You know, one of those numbers repeated here and over here. So, uh, but you need at least, oh, you need at least five on this one here. The five unique digits because these five are in the same box. So, and we know these can't be one or nine because of these one and nine. So, if this was two, you'd have three, four, five, six, seven. You'd have, yeah. So, these would have to be two and eight, and these are going to have to be three, four, five, six, and seven. Um, these are also going to have to be from 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7, but not not all four of them. So, so now, I wonder if these have to be 3 and 7 then, because, right, because we've already used 1, 2, 8, and 9, and we need to have three unique digits in between these two, so these are going to have to be 3 and 7 with 4, 5, and 6 in between. Perfect. Uh... Now these three are also going to have to be 4, 5, and 6, just to complete the row there. Let's see, there's 1, 2, so there's only 4 digits in between these, so this could be a lot of things. It could be anything but 5, basically, because you could do 1 and 6, um, 4 and 9, uh, or, or any other, you know, 1 and 9, 1 and 8, 1 and 7, 2 and 8. You know, there's a lot of things you could do with these. They just can't have 5 in them. Same thing on this side. Is there anything we can do with this 28? So, if this was, could this be 1, I guess is the question, right? Could that be 1? The maximum we can put in here is 8 and 7, because if this is 1, this is 9. So we could do 8 and 7, and this could be 9. So 8 and 7 is 15, and 9 is 24. 1 would be 25. So this can't be 1. It wouldn't be able to get to 28. So we can fill those four in. Uh, I don't know what that really does for us, though, because we already had 
you know, the one and the nine eliminated from these and the, the columns. Ah, so I guess this one can't be one or nine. So that gives us a little bit of a limiting. Um, it could still be one over here, though. And this could still be two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Yeah, there's a lot of options there. What about this 28 through here? Because as we just saw over here, uh, we're somewhat limited on how low the numbers can go. And we've actually got... So one of these has to be high and one of them has to be low. Right? Uh, so even if this is one, two, three, four, five, this would have to be at least six. So one of them's low, one of them's high. And if one of them is, even if this one is nine, this one would have to be at most four. So one of them is going to have to be small, and we still have this 28 limit. So if we have eight and seven in here, because you can't ever put a one or a nine on a between line, because there's nothing to go in the circle that's going to be bigger or smaller depending on which way you go so eight and seven is the biggest we can put on these two that's 15. now if we have nine and four for example that's the biggest we can put on the circles right so 15 and 9 is 24 and 4 is 28 so we that's what we have to do it has to be four and nine and in fact it's going to have to be in this order because of the nine down here four and nine these are going to have to be 7 and 8. Now that gives us 5 and 6 here because in order to have 4 digits between 4 and 9, it has to be 5, 6, 7, and 8. So, uh, let's see. So 1, 2, th okay, and the 9 has to be in here. The 4 can be in any of those, and so can the 1. Maybe. Can the one be right here? I wonder if the one can be there because of the 41 clue. Let's see, we could do 8, 7, 8, that's 15, 23, and 9 is 32. Yeah, you're going to be able to put a one there still. That's going to be possible. Uh, the nines over here have to go in these. Now, on this one, we can no longer have a nine on the circle because we have nines looking at both of them. So, eight and three is the most we can do there. But we can still do... There's We don't have the same problem because there's not the little killer on this one. So, we can't put a four on here anymore. And we couldn't put a five before. So, eight, three, seven, two. You could have a one up here, though. Uh, these are one, one, two, and eight. Uh, so, but that can still be eight. I feel like these bigger little killers aren't going to be super helpful yet, but maybe we can look at this one. So nine, we've got a nine here. So that leaves 19 for these three. But there's quite a few options there because so eight and seven is the max here, which gives us four there, but this could be up to nine. So I don't think that's going to do much for us. Okay, what else can we do? So, two, eight, four, five, six. Ah, where can, oh, oh, right. So, so I just said that you can't put a one or a nine on a between line, which means in box five, the one and the nine have to go in the middle here because they can't go on the lines here and they can't be down here. So that's the one and the nine, which means this is not one, this is not one. That puts the one on the circle there, okay. So two, three, four, five. So this has to be at least six. So it's six, seven, or eight. Can't be nine. And it has to be at least six just to have enough um, digits in between. So one, so th this is three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Two, 
two, eight, one, nine. So these are also three, four, five, six, seven. Plus five. Ah, three, four, five, six, seven. We have we have three, four, five, six, seven um quintuples here, basically. So this is two, eight, and nine. And this is 2, 8, and 1, but we can get rid of the 1 and the 9 here. So we've got a 2, 8 pair along here as well. Ah, and so, oh, and 2, 8 pairs in the column. So this is 9, and this is 1. Okay, so 1, 1, there needs to be a 1 up here. There needs to be a 9 up here. Oh, and now we've got, remember up here we said that the one and the four could both be in these, but now that we've got this one, can't have ones in any of those. So this is a one nine pair. And that puts the four up here because this four rules out those. So this is then two and three. So these are five, six, seven, and eight. Four, four, there's a four. Four down here. Oh, four, five, six. This can't be five or six. We can't put a four there. So there's a four in one of these. Don't know how helpful that is. Um, and the same up here with, with the ones. We've got a one, nine pair right here again. The eight has to be in one of these because it can't go on the between line unless there's a nine in the circle. So the eight is in one of those. If this is eight, then the eight is up there. But if it's not, then the eight could be in either one of these. Ah, ah, but, so the eight has to be in one of these. Um, we don't know where yet, but it can't be in row two is the important thing. And eight also can't be in row two in this box. So the eight must be Right there, which gives us eight and seven. These are not sevens. Uh, this is, oh, no, we don't know. So seven is in here. There's a seven up top here. Now, the only way seven can be there is if this is an eight. But we don't know that yet. Ah, but the seven here gives us the three and the seven, which means this is not a seven. So the seven is across the top here no matter what, but that doesn't tell us whether it's a seven or eight in there yet. So, oh, the four here means that's not a four. Uh, oh, four, five, six. Right, right, right. So we can get rid of four, five, six. This is a three, seven pair. So this is not three or seven. So we've got our four, five, six triple there. So these two have to be the same as those two. Or whatever that's worth. <laughs> um, let's see. What else can we do? So... Can we use any of these little killers yet? Oh, so we've got two nines now. Right, so we've got two nines on this 28 little killer. So that's 18, so we need 10 in here. And it can't be one nine. Right, so if this was nine, this would have to be one to finish off the little killer. So this can't be nine, which means our nine is there. That gives us one, oop, and nine, ah. Nine, there we go. If I can type one and nine there. Um, and that one means this is not a one, so we get our one there. One, so there's a one in here. There's a nine in here. Okay, so we need 10. It can't be one nine. It could be, uh, it can't be two eight because we've already got two eight here. So this one can't be two or eight. So it could be three, seven or four, six. But four, five, six triple here means this can't be three, six. So it has, or four, six. So it has to be three, seven. And this has to be the three and the seven. And that gives us the three and the seven down here. This is not seven. Now what do we have left? Four, five, and six. Sounds familiar. Okay, that one can't be four. 
So we have a five, six pair. So that means two, three, and seven are left in the column. And this three puts the three down there. Nice. Now that two, seven, it's going to get rid of the seven there. So two, four, five, six, eight. Yeah, two, four, five, six, eight. Okay. Um. All right. I'm gonna look at the little killer here. Maybe I don't know. Hmm. Which one should we look at? Um. They just seem like there's way too many options still. But okay, let's look at this one. So we've got four and seven already. So that's 11, so we need 30 in the rest. So let's just go with the maximums and see how much freedom we have. So we need 30. Seven and eight, that's 15 and seven is 22. This could be, we could be at 30 already without even considering this one. So that's, it's not gonna be very helpful. Okay, so these are two, seven and eight. Ah, uh, this one can't be seven, so that's two, eight. Oh, this one can't be seven. Ah, two, eight. Okay, so this is seven. There we go. Uh, oh, I guess should have already known that because we have the five, six, eight triple here. But that's all right. That's seven. Um, these can't be fours. Okay, so that little killer diagonal didn't really help us at all. Uh, maybe there's just so many options still with these. So this is 10. We need 32 more. We've got seven, 14, 22, 29. That would leave three here, but this can be up to eight. So This can't be seven anymore because of the seven here. So this is six or eight. If it's six, these are two, three, four, five. If this is six, this would have to be six. These are two would have to be seven, eight. Seems, seems like it's possible. Ah, interesting. If this is six, Right, if this is six, the six goes up here. So seven and eight are here, which makes that a two. If this is not six, then this is eight, which makes that a two. So either way, that one is a two. So, and we have a four, five, six triple here, which means this is not four. Oh, we have a five, six pair, I guess, which makes that a four, but this is also uh, a two. And now we've got five, six, and nine for the column. And now we have a five, six, nine triple, which makes this eight. Uh, okay, so two, 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 uh, that's, this is not four. So this is four, five, six, and eight. And it has to have four and eight in here. Okay, I'm going to look at this diagonal, because we do have a few that are somewhat, like this one is a maximum of three, this one's a maximum of six, so let's just see, three, nine, and seven, 19, 27, 33, 41 already, yeah, so there's lots of, lots of flexibility there. Well... 41 and eight, yeah, we've got eight. So yeah, you, you could even put a two here if everything else was the maximums. So, ah, but now we've got the sevens here. So that puts a seven up there. So whichever one is here, whether this is a six or an eight, the other one has to be up here. If it's, ah, but if it's eight, you can put a six on the line. If it's six, then this is eight right here. But we can't say the same thing. Because if, if this is six, you can't put an eight on the line. But if it's eight, you can put a six on the line. 
this is eight, there'd be an eight there, this would be two. If this is six, there'd be a six there, this would be five, yeah. Okay, let's see, what else can we do? It's gotta be these little killers, right? Oh, now we've got the two here. So now we're, we're getting a little more, so 13. So we need 28, 15 and seven is 22. So this needs to be at least six, right? Oh, and it can't be seven, eight or nine. I think that has to be at least six, right? So two and seven is nine and four is 13. And seven is 28, 35. Yes, yeah, so you need at least six. So this has to be six then. Oh, whoa, we just want that one to be six, not all this. <laughs> so, and, and in fact, these all have to be the maximums, don't they? That's gonna give us quite a bit. Uh, so this now has to be an eight because of the six. These are not sevens. These two are not sixes. This is not a six. Okay, and since that's an eight, this has to be an eight. So that gives us the two, three, two, these are three, four, five, and six. This one can't be three. Two can't, two has to be here. Ah, but it can't be, this has to be the two because of these twos here. Eliminate all those. And this one can't be two because of that. So that's a two, which gives us a one, two pair in the middle here. Uh, this can't be six anymore. These are three, four, and five. This one can't be four. Five, four, five. This can't be six or eight. So we have a four, five pair giving us a three there. This is not three. We have four, five pair. Five, six, one. Oh, the seven. It's the two and the seven and the one and the two and the one gives us the nine and the one this is not nine this is nine six three four five three four five six yeah uh okay now this has to be a five or a six. Okay, so we have a four, five, six triple, putting an eight down here. This has to be three, four, five, and six. Okay, now, now we're gonna have to use the little killers to figure out the rest probably. Okay, so we've got eight, 16, 23, and 10 is 33. We need nine more, which is gonna have to be six, six and three or five and four. So that's a three or four with a five or a six. All right, maybe we'll look at this one. So the maximums we can do would be five and eight, that's 13, 19, 27, 34, 42, the maximum is 42. So this has to be an eight then. We've only got one degree of freedom. So this one can't be a four. This one has to be, oh, this one has to be an eight, two. Um, three, four, five, six. Okay, so these, we can only have one, two of these have to be their maximum. So it could be six, six, four. Let's just double check that. But I think these have to be, those three have to be 16. So we've got 16 and nine is, right? Yeah, 16 and nine is 25. So we need 16, right? So this could be six, six, five, or six, six, four, or five, five, six. If this is four, five, six, five, right? So if this is four, you're gonna have five, six, five. So if this is four, this is five. But four and five, you're not gonna be able to get to 16. So this can't be four. The 
this is five, four, five, six, four. That's three, six pair, so five and four. These are not fours. That's a six and a five and a five. And so now we've got five and five. So this one has to be six to finish off that little killer. Uh, this is not six. Ooh. Five there gives us the four and the three and the six and the three. Uh, and then these cannot be five, so we have a three, four pair giving us a five there and a six there. That gives us the five and the six. That five is going to give us four and five, which is then going to give us the four and the three in the middle. Five here gives us that six and five and six. And our timer turns green, which means we've got the right answer. So there you go. That was Between Little Killers by Dida, I think is how we're pronouncing that. Uh, that was a fun puzzle. Uh, betweens are often um, pretty restrictive when you're trying to, or I mean pretty difficult when you're trying to make a puzzle because they're not as restrictive as some other um, things like little killers help a lot here. But it was kind of cool how we actually had to use, well, I don't know if we had to, but we did use the, the 28 little killer right away at the beginning. A lot of times little killers with other variants tend to be kind of, um, you'd use all the other variants, and then you do the little killer to disambiguate at the end. And we had some of that with the longer ones, but we used the the shorter ones, the 28s, uh, pretty early on. So that was kind of neat to see that. Uh, that was a fun puzzle. Um, if you tried it, let me know what you thought, and I'll see you again soon with another puzzle. Thanks. Bye.